I mean, I always tell my clients this, we're definitely not selling the least expensive products in the market, nor do I want to, because I don't think you've ever heard in your life, it's the best quality and it's the cheapest. Yeah. Never. They don't even <laughs> go in the same sentence. So this is another example of that. It's absolutely you're paying for that quality, but it's also going to be a product that you're going to be able to use for years and years. My famous line I say to my clients, like the most expensive product is the one that you have to buy and then it breaks and I have to buy it again and it breaks. And I would rather spend a little bit more money up front and have a product that'll last me, you know, a much longer time period than buying the cheapest thing and then replacing it three times. with the Hive podcast. Today I have Jeff Harris with me and we're going to talk about the renowned speaker brand Bang & Olufsen. Thank you so much for having me. appreciate being here. Yeah. So uh, I just wanted to get started. Obviously people that know b they just love it for its design and quality. Can you tell me what sets this brand apart from other speaker companies? Sure. A little of the history of Bang & Olufsen. It was actually started in, uh, it's a Danish speaker manufacturer, started in 1925 actually by Peter Bang and Sven Olufsen. And uh, they actually were the first ones to design a radio um, that worked on alternating current, and which was pretty uh, ahead of their time because most radios at the time worked on batteries. What's the difference between those two? So one's plugged into power in the wall and one was portable and battery operated and when the batteries ran out you replaced batteries. So it was the first plug-in alternating current AC uh, radio that was about, so it was ahead of their time. That's really cool. Yeah. <laughs> so one of the things they were known for is actually putting speakers into Ford cars. The Ford Panther had Bang & Olufsen speakers. So throughout the years, but it was kind of a cool story. In 1959, they were actually written up in a magazine to say that they looked like they were designed by a potato farmer out of an outhouse door. So they took high offense to that. And uh, at that time, they went out and sought after some of the most world-renowned furniture designers. And since then, Bang & Olufsen not only has been known for their unbelievable quality of sound, but also for their exquisite design like no other brand that's known in the marketplace. Wow, that's really great. Can you tell me a little bit about their product offerings and some that stand out, um, maybe some best sellers that you offer through BNO? Sure. I mean, it's funny. We have a couple uh, products here. And the reality is there's basically three different product lines by Bang & Olsen. We have their completely portable line, which they have products from their Explorer, which is $199 retail. This is the Beolite 20. This is a portable speaker as well, kind of cool. Has its own battery charger for your phone on the top of it. You simply lay your phone up on top and it charges it. Then they have another portable, the A3. They have really awesome portable products. And again, starting out at $199 with some really great sound quality. Then we move into what we call their Flex line, which these are different speakers that can be placed throughout the home. So they are hardwired to power. So they're not portable battery operated. Okay. But the neat thing about them is we can literally pick them up, move them anywhere throughout the house, plug them into a power outlet, and then they communicate over WISA, which is a very, very high-end uh, CD superior than CD quality sound completely wirelessly. Wow. And then we get into what we call kind of their performance or their stage product, which is this is more of their traditional speakers that would accompany, for example, in your living room that would be either floor standing or wall mounted, um, their theater sound bar, um, also called their Bayo Lab 20. They also have their Bayo Lab 50s. They have their Bayo Lab 90s, which these are their performance high end stage speakers that would be in a surround sound type of environment. So we have the three different types again. So we have your totally portable, we have your flex line that can be moved anywhere but hardwired into power, and then you have your stage line that again is more of your large tower type of speakers that you know would go into like a surround sound type of environment in your living room. That's pretty cool. And one thing I noticed being in the showroom with all of these products is these little portable speakers are quite powerful in the sound. 
um, you know, quality is quite incredible for something that's portable, but then you move into, you know, something like the A1 or the big disc, you know, and, and then you move to the sound bar and the quality just, you know, remains very constant. Do you see with customers that they mix and match these in their home or, you know, are people like that want the hardwired only go with the hardwired or how do you see customers liking the product? It's a great question. I mean, one of the things that Bang & Olsen's known for is their completely wireless technology. Believe it or not, this right here on the wall is the Bang & Olsen shape, which this has a fully amplified, this is a fully self-contained sound system. Wow. So it's got a streamer inside there, which you could stream wirelessly mm -hmm. uh, any of the music that you'd want from the different sources such as Pandora or Spotify and the streamer. It's got an amplifier and the speakers built in. Wow. This comes in 10 different color choices. So those covers can pop off and you can put different colors. We have a combination of a couple colors there. Um, they even have them in wood. So of course that would go over the areas that don't have a speaker. Um, uh, behind them, but the amplifier or the streamer. So this can be totally self-contained, literally needs a power outlet behind it and can run completely wirelessly. Again, one of the big points is we have, you asked the question about flexibility throughout the house. Again, the portable devices, this is more for, you know, the beach. This is more for a bike ride, totally portable, can go anywhere with us. Mm -hmm. Then the Flex product is really the one that you mentioned, the large disc, that's actually the number one selling speaker. It's called the A9, and it's the number one sold speaker in the entire lineup. It is one of the most powerful speakers uh, in the lineup and at a really incredible price point. Totally flexible, can be moved anywhere around the house. The design is so cool. Um, so we definitely see clients that, for example, put a portable one on their nightstand and then they want to tie it wirelessly together with the A9 that may sit out in the gym or in the living room. And then they have the surround sound in their TV room. So all of these can play in concert together from a single app. You can literally launch any of the different speakers throughout the home. Wow, that's really cool. So you were talking about the different levels and we were talking a little bit about um, you know, how people would apply and use them. Do you find that people mix the flex with the stage line throughout their home? Is there a certain buyer that likes this product more than other? Does it work better in certain applications than others? So, I mean, honestly, our clientele that buys Bang & Olsen is that discerning client that has wants the highest quality sound with the highest quality visual aesthetic in their room. Um, more times than not, I get people that are like, oh my God, I thought that was a statue or a sculpture. They don't even realize it's a speaker. Wow. Um, the sound quality is you know, second to none, incredible quality. But again, there is no company in the market that has designed a speaker that has the same look with the quality of Bang & Olsen. One of my favorite applications, honestly, is high-end condos because oftentimes we can't run a hard wire to a speaker, which, you know, very high-end audiophiles love hardwired speakers. This gives that same, again, client with that discerning ear that wants that quality the absolute best product to do it wirelessly. I often refer to it in slightly as a joke as Rich Man Sonos uh, because it does give you that incredible wireless flexibility, but at the highest end quality. Um, I love it in our high-end condos where we have a concrete ceiling, marble floors and glass walls. We can't run a single wire anywhere. What better way to do it than plug these into power and then you have some of the best quality sound and an incredibly cool look. That's really cool, especially when you live in a city like we're in, a lot of waterfront condos, you can still deliver that luxury sound experience and aesthetic without, you know, uh, having to go in and do a lot of construction to run those wires. Absolutely. I mean, they have the stage, which is their sound bar, um, and then they have another level of sound bar called the theater. It is one of the world's most expensive. We've done this in previous videos that we show our clients um, of the world's most expensive sound bar. I mean, it ranges in price from ten to twelve thousand um, dollars. We has these absolutely beautiful wooden or walnut lamella, which is these small wooden slats on the front of the speaker. Once again, uh, people don't even know it's a speaker. Um, and it's a full Atmos surround sound uh, speaker built into a very small framework and package that goes beneath the TV. And that can also then be working in concert with 
Uh, a pair of right and left speakers and rear speakers can be fully run in a wireless surround sound application. And then again, you can add a subwoofer to it. So oftentimes I've had a client that starts with this mass, you know, beautiful, magnificent soundbar, and then they grow the system and add the side right and left audio, and then they add the rear. So it continued to evolve. And the cool thing is you can add all the product completely wirelessly. That's really awesome. I really love like just looking around here the aesthetic of the speakers is like nothing you've ever seen like the one over there what what is that one that's over there that's the A9 the A9 that's one of again that's one of their most popular speakers it looks like a spaceship guys yeah. <laughs> we'll show you a clip of it but it is absolutely gorgeous and it's like and i know that comes in a lot of different finishes but yeah. it's just something that's like can you believe that's a speaker sure so this this is the A9. So yeah, um, definitely uh, neat. We have right here the Halo, which is their remote control um, for the system. And then again, this is the A9. Uh, it comes in several different finishes. This is also one of the things that's unlike any other manufacturer. These can all be done in bespoke colors meaning we many times have a client or a designer that wants a very specific color and they're doing an emerald green in the entire room. So this can literally be made in any, wow. this is an anodized aluminum. So we can, you could pick the color and we can literally make that in any color. We've done it for a client, a, a very rust, very pink, a Barbie pink. And then we've done it also in an emerald green. So um, Ferrari did a collection with Bang & Olufsen and it came out in a Ferrari red. It was just magnificent and we sold several of those. Um, they also had a Ferrari red that came out with the Explorer. So again, anything with their aluminum finish on it can be put in a bespoke color. Wow, that's really cool. I mean, if I was a high-end buyer, homeowner, designer, I would all day design one of these speakers to match my room and it's just like, you think it is art, honestly, yeah. looking at it. And what's this little thing here? That's actually the tweeter. That's a omnibus tweeter, which can give you literally 360 degree dispersion out of the, the high range. Um, so again, very cool look, um, you know, and as well as the multiple different drivers, meaning the different speakers that are in these to, to produce 360 degree sound. So. Again, very, very cool product. One of my favorites, personally, pound for pound, dollar for dollar, the Beam, um, which is the other one that we have located over there in the corner. Um, that's one of my favorites for, like, again, really, it, these things can fill an entire room with a very, very small footprint. So the quality of the sound is uh, second to none. Yeah, and the biggest question, how do you feel when you plug this in <laughs> and let her play? Well, listen, that's, you know, again, I love the, the gadgets. Um, uh, for me, uh, the, 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 the emotion that these speakers bring and the quality, it's, it's really, really impressive. And, you know, the, the neat thing is to see people's eyes light up when they actually start to realize that that's a speaker, right? Yeah. So, so often people are looking at it, you know, kind of, you know, with curiosity and then you fire it up and it's like, what? Oh my God, it, you know, again, it's like at first they recognize that it's a speaker and, and not some cool looking art statue in their room. The same thing with the, the Bayo Lab 20s. Uh, they actually open up and uh, we'll put that in, in the video, but the reality is the speaker itself literally opens up. Yeah. So, and if you put it in stereo, it opens up in a smaller fashion, you open it up full into surround sound, let front wooden lamella, the wooden curtains, if you will, actually open up on the speaker. So again, the, 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 the fit, the finish, the quality, it's, it, it is second to none. And it, it's, it's, again, some of it's also a little bit of the, uh, you know, the wow element and the wow factor to it. So, which they definitely, you know, I don't think there's any speaker manufacturer on the market that has the wow factor that Bang & Olsen has from an aesthetic. Yeah, and just, you know, because we can't play sound through a video <laughs> and have people experience these speakers because yeah. they are quite incredible when you sit in front of them. I just want to share the story of when we had a movie star in here from the movie A Star is Born. Yes. And we played um, one of your favorite scenes <laughs> in the movie of Bradley Cooper and Lady Gaga singing together in the first time that they sang together on stage. And he sat in front of those speakers you're talking about 
and he had a tear roll down his eye yeah. just because the quality of the sound and you know when he's in Hollywood and listening you know in their studios he said it just brought so much emotion on how powerful uh, the sound was when it came out of the speaker. So I yeah. just, I yeah. remember that because, you yeah. know, somebody of that caliber that hears some of the best speakers in the studios in Hollywood was so emotionally moved by the sound and quality of those speakers. Yeah, absolutely. He's a, he's a good friend of ours and, uh, and uh, he's, he's, you know, he was definitely moved, you know, and it actually <laughs> moved him. He ended up uh, purchasing you know, from us based on that, believe it or not, and uh, so it was it was a cool moment um, to see him on screen in front of it and, and get moved by that. So it was kind of cool. One of the things I do want to point out is this right here. We glance over the, this right here is their um, Halo remote control. This yeah. is actually a touchscreen remote. The outside band again can be in many different fits and finishes or bespoke in color, and then it has your LED touchscreen. Uh, there as well and it can be navigated from this on the outside so again you know having that sitting on the counter or on the coffee table people don't even recognize you know they, they want to pick it up and play they don't even know what it is so again you know the, the cool factor is a 10 when it comes to Bang & Olsen. Yeah that's awesome and uh, one thing you touched on I think a lot of viewers might be a little bit more interested to hear more about it you talked about WISA which is their ability to play sound through Wi-Fi. Um, I'm just kind of curious from the consumer perspective, how does th their product differ from what usually happens when you're streaming audio? That's a great question. WISA was a conglomerate of about six different manufacturers, Bang & Olsen, one of them for their wireless sound technology. And, you know, oftentimes, you know, streaming sound, there's a lot of loss. Um, so you've seen all the major manufacturers, Apple, with their lossless music, because oftentimes when they're compressing it and streaming it, that's what they really, when they do that compression process and then run it through a streamer, oftentimes you lose a lot of the picture quality. And, and that's me, what lossless and, means, is that you're not losing the quality. Correct. So that's what the the name brand, if you will, of Apple's product. So WISA is uh, the highest quality of wireless audio available right now wow. in the marketplace. And one of the founding partners of that technology was Bang & Olufsen. So again, you're getting superior than CD quality sound mm -hmm. completely wirelessly. So this is where it really takes the cake compared to a lot of the other manufacturers out there um, of its ability to communicate wirelessly. Uh, and do it with such a superior sound quality. That's cool. Yeah. I really enjoy learning about the technology of these things. Yeah. Um, I do want to bring over the speaker from the corner over there, which you mentioned is one of your favorite of the yeah, Flex speakers. The Beam. Yeah. Um, the beam. Yeah. Again, multiple drivers, mid-range tweeters, again, within this small footprint. Uh, neat thing is it's controlled from the top here, the volume control, you can pause and play. Um, you know, and again, you can use this standalone, it can be used in the app, and then you can also use this with multiple different speakers tied together in concert. So you can even buy these in a pair, so you could have two of them in a room. Two um, in a room? That yeah. thing's powerful. <laughs> so. You're gonna wake up all the neighbors and have them calling somebody to complain. <laughs> so, <I laughs> Unless mean, you invite them to the party, of course. Sure. So, <laughs> or we can have them, you know, distributed throughout the home in different rooms, different locations. So if you're having a party and you wanted to have this playing in the parlor at the same time it's playing in the living room, you know, these oftentimes end up on an end table or a kitchen counter. Um, or, you know, a coffee table. So the neat thing is they can be dispersed throughout the home and you can have that kind of quality sound wirelessly doing what we call distributed audio without the old traditional volume controls, hardwired speakers, amplifiers, and a great expense of infrastructure. You could have this distributed audio literally by just placing any one of these flex lines throughout the house. So anything with a cord, basically you can set up and then have multiple of them playing the same song or different songs at the same time. Yep. Wow, that's pretty cool. So what you cannot do, you can't take this Bluetooth speaker 
and then play this in conjunction with the flex. Yeah. You cannot do that. But you could take any of the flex line and play it together with the flex line. And you could actually take any of the stage line of that speaker and play it with the flex so they can play throughout. Yeah. There are a couple, of, so there are a couple exceptions to the rule. There are a couple of the higher end, which they can be either part of this flex line. This is designed to be totally standalone by itself. You know, you don't have two of these that play in concert, just like you'd have a pair of headphones or headphones aren't designed to play with three other pair of headphones. So any of this portable line, it's designed to be standalone by itself. So the flex line, it's designed to play in that distributed audio type of setup. That's really cool. It seems like B&O really thinks about the consumer and how they would use the products. And it's really for that modern buyer that really loves technology and wants it to look and sound great too. Yep. We also have a one product and I'll finish with this. It's called the Level and it actually has a magnetic plug on the back of it. It's completely portable. So the neat thing is it plugs into power. It has about a 12 hour battery life and it just a magnet boot pops off. So I've done this many times with clients, condo, sits on the kitchen counter, that's their awesome speaker, and then they wanna take it out on the patio. So again, they don't have wires out there, they're not penetrating the outside of the building. Boom, magnet, they lay it down outside, have it on the patio, bring it back in, plug it into the magnet, take it to the beach, but it's got about a 12 hour battery life, so it's kinda of cool, and again, cool. awesome design, super easy, not even plug, unplug, it's like a magnetic disc, pops on the back of the level, so really, really cool product. Yeah, I think you showed that in one of your other videos. Yeah. On so um, you were talking about uh, headphones and magically they appeared. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, Megan Olson. You know, again, really, guys, uh, you, you have to see it to appreciate it. Even their metal and aluminum working. I mean, some of the best aluminum work in the world. I mean, you can feel it just on the hinges and the incredible quality. Um, really, really awesome. The, the, there is no finish again. Uh, you know, aluminum, they do the aluminum casting and the work and the anodization of the aluminum. Um, literally, they build, you know, the, the grills for Rolls Royce. Wow, uh, so, I didn't know that. Yeah, I mean, if you look at the hinges, I mean, again, it's just all the little fine details of this. This is all made out of metal, which so many of the other manufacturers, this is all plastic. plastic. So, you know, again, you're getting just incredible quality here. I mean, you're looking at a price point around $999. They even have a price point down at $400 um, with still, again, nothing competes with the quality at those price points. And why would you say, like, you know, buying a pair of $1,000 headphones uh, would be worth it compared to, you know, your average Beats headphones that a lot of our users probably know and love. What what would set this apart from your average product? And and I'm I want to say this being you know with utmost respect. I mean Beats makes a nice headphone for that price point. But again, uh, you know it's like anything else in life. Why is it more expensive? Some things are just no no reason they're more expensive. Uh, Bang and Olsen is that quality, right? Mm -hmm. You're going to get the quality of the full grain leather. You're going to yeah, get the quality you can see of the, the foam. Leather here. So you're going to get the quality of all this being, you know, aluminum machined aluminum, mm -hmm. um, the durability of these and the sound quality. I mean, um, you know, Bang & Olsen builds stuff that honestly is like heirloom product. Yeah, maybe they're portable stuff here. They want to have entry level products that the average consumer can afford. Um, but they literally build products that are designed to be heirlooms that you'll pass these down to your children because they're that good of quality. I mean, some of their product, they're actually retrofitting it and bringing so some of their vintage recorders and, 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 and record players and speakers, putting technology in it today to bring them so they can actually still work with the same ecosystem of the current day model. So it's kind of cool that they're always very forward thinking to make sure that these products are going to, you know, be used for years and years to come. I talk about this on a daily basis with my clients. Uh, some of the products we sell, I mean, I always tell my clients this, we're definitely not selling the least expensive products in the market, nor do I want to. Because I don't think you've ever heard in your life, it's the best quality and it's the cheapest. Yeah. Never. They don't even <laughs> go in the same sentence. So this is another example of that. It's absolutely you're paying for that quality, but it's also going to be a product that you're going to be able to use for years and years. My famous line I say to my clients, like the most expensive product is the one that you have to buy 
and then it breaks and I have to buy it again and it breaks and I would rather spend a little bit more money up front and have a product that will last me you know a much longer time period than buying the cheapest thing and then replacing it three times so you know this is definitely that quality that you're getting across the entire Bang & Olsen lineup if you're looking for the least expensive product you know this is not the right product for you mm -hmm. uh, if you're looking for some of the best quality product at a fair price point at every step of it, I think that you'll find Bang & Olsen fits the bill. And beautiful. I mean, there's yeah. there, there's no I mean, one that compares to that. There's no one, honestly, that oh, compares God. the aesthetics of anything in their lineup. There is no other manufacturer. And I rep a lot of other speaker brands that, you know, quality, sound quality, I'll even compare it to. Um, but there's nobody in the business that makes the beauty with the sound quality packaged together in their packaging is second to none that's really cool i mean i've just really enjoyed coming here and seeing mm -hmm. all of the products i think we covered actually a lot of products yeah. um and you know key points about them during this podcast awesome. uh i'm just curious you know if there's is there's anything else that you just have to tell us about bang and olfson or the product while we're here today you know, the, the last thing I'd say is honestly, there's nothing that, and you hit on that earlier, there's nothing that replaces coming in and hearing them live, right? You're welcome to do it in our showroom or any other Bang & Olsen showroom around the world because to go in there and really experience it, you know, even if we put them on now, you're going to listen to them through the speakers of whatever device, whether it's your mobile device or it's your, you know, your car or, you know, potentially your, your computer. Um, there's nothing that really replaces it. Take the time, go for that experience, sit down, listen to them, go to one of the, the showrooms that has multiple different devices and see what's right for you. Cause you know, not every speaker, and this is why they make them in different shapes and sizes and styles and price points, because you know, it's, you know, we fit it to the environment. We fit it to, you know, the need and the want and the assessment of that. So treat yourself, go out there and actually have a listen to them. so much for tuning in to another episode of the Hive Podcast. Feel free to check out our website, hivestyle.com, to learn more about some of the product offerings we have and see real client successes. Put your comments below for any questions you might have or things that you loved about this. We love your feedback. Thanks again.